Hello everyone, this is Yomi and welcome to another free watercolor paint along. I have prepared a sketch that you can copy or print in the discussion tab of this event and today we will be doing a healthy toast painting. Here are the colors that we will be using for today. Permanent yellow, yellow ochre, cadmium orange, yellow green, brown, and van dyke brown. Now, if you are done with your sketch and you are ready, let's paint! We're going to use permanent yellow as the base color for our bread and the butter under the egg. We're also going to use permanent yellow for the egg yolk. So we're just going to leave a small space of white color in the top as the reflection of the light. While it's still wet, as you can see here, we're going to drop cadmium orange. So you can drop the cadmium orange on the side and also in the middle part of our egg yolk. Using the tip of your brush, gently brush or drag the color around the egg yolk to make a lighter shade of the cadmium orange. Again, you can drop another layer of cadmium orange to make it darker or a little bit darker than the first one.
we're going to darken the egg yolk by using permanent yellow as a second layer. Okay, now you can just fix the side or the shape of your egg yolk using the excess paint from the first two colors that you use. For the white of your egg, we're going to mix permanent yellow and yellow green, just a small amount of yellow green to our permanent yellow and more water to make a lighter shade and we're just going to create these broken lines around the egg yolk. You can also add dots here and some darker random lines around the yolk. Now for the side of our toast, we're going to use brown, Van Dyke brown, and yellow ochre. So you're going to alternately apply each color on the side of our toast. Okay, now I'm going to use yellow ochre first around here so for the lighter shade will be yellow ochre and then continue it with brown color you can also add a small amount of cadmium orange to your brown so it will have like yellow or i mean orangey color to your toasted bread so here is my brown with a small amount of orange and then later, you can also add Van Dyke Brown here for the darker shade. And continue doing this around or for the whole side of your toast.
Now, we're going to add a darker shade of brown by applying more paint, less water. So as you can see, once it dries, it will have a lighter shade. So we're going to reapply some of this orangey brown color. Now we're going to paint the inner part of the bread or the bread part of the toast and we're going to avoid painting the butter so I'm just going to draw lines here so this will be the edge of the butter we're going to use the tip of our brush and do the dubbing technique to create the sponge like texture of our bread Now for the darker shade, we're going to use brown color 
and we're going to reduce some of the lines um, around the butter and also the sponge like texture of our bread Now let's go back to the edge of our toasted bread. We're going to reapply the brown color and we're also going to add the darker shade or the shadow part or the shadow color of our toasted bread which is the Van Dyke Brown. Here we're going to use yellow ochre as a shadow for the butter. So we're just going to create random lines around the egg.
Let's use the same color to re-outline or outline our egg so it will be visible to the eye. While we are waiting for this to dry, I wanted to take this chance to thank um, Miss Christina Kwan and Miss Lizelle for the stars. They are my star senders from last time. So I want to say thank you, thank you very much. Now we're going to continue our painting. We're going to use Van Dyke Brown and we're going to um, splash some Van Dyke Brown on our toast. It will serve as the grounded pepper so all we have to do is top it on our finger as you can see here I'm topping it around careful not to put some paints outside the toast now once you're done with the uh, smaller parts of the pepper or the black pepper we're now going to create a bigger chunks of black pepper around so I'm just going to randomly add this pepper around my eggs or over my egg and also my butter and the bread Okay, now after the pepper, we're now going to use yellow green color for the onion chives as a garnish for our toasted bread. Okay, I might have skipped a few minutes because my camera suddenly stops and I forgot to check it out. So now I'm going to reduce some parts of the pepper and also add more um, garnish by using yellow green color or the onion chives. And that's it now we're done with our healthy toast 
all we have to do is add our signature here and then you're done so thank you for joining me today and i hope you could share your output in the discussion tab of this event or tag me if you ever post it on your other social medias i hope everyone enjoyed this and join me again next week bye everyone stay safe